So, it's Friday morning, and I'm still in Givat Olga, and I feel like I'm in the 1990s. I, I walked back into Israel in the 1990s. It's like, uh, I'll show you the neighborhood here. I'm going to turn it yeah. See. The newer city over there in the far, you see it over there by the far. That's where the, that's towards the beach over there. I just want to show my surroundings really quick, but I, um, what I wanted to share was some thoughts that I had. Um, I'm on day three of my journey and just kind of letting things unfold for me as I go. And one of the thoughts that I just had and that I wanted to share was, uh, yesterday, Mom and I were driving, and uh, I was the passenger, and uh, I started telling her about her tailgating. Now, I know that she doesn't like me talking about her driving, and she seems to do just fine when I'm not there, so, you know, when I'm there, and then I know that when I say, hey, watch it, oh, duh, that it scares her. So then she jumps, and then she gets mad at me for, you know, quit being a passenger driver. And then I remember that I don't like having passenger drivers. So all of this negativity is going on in my head, right? You know, thinking about what's going to happen, we're going to run into somebody, or all this negativity, right? And so lately, um, not only have I been really trying, really watching the thoughts that I allow to be in my mind, but Mom is on this amazing path of her own. And uh, she's, um, and she's doing really well on her path. I'm really happy for her, but on her path, and she's really watching her thoughts and she says to me, so Ima, I don't want all this negativity in my life. Just stop talking about it. So I just look out the window when she gets after me. I look up at the clouds. And it passes any kinds of thoughts. Okay, so wait, I'll show you the clouds. I was just looking up at the clouds. Look at those clouds. See? And then I realize that what I, uh, what I am doing is I'm buffering. I'm using the clouds as a frequency or mode buffer to get out of that negativity I, I look at cloud buffers so if I'm thinking something that's making me feel inadequate or anything less than perfect or that or making me worry or I'm getting into the past or I'm getting into and I need to get back into the present and I want to clear out my thoughts then I just look for a cloud buffer and so I told my mom, hey, I'm looking at a cloud buffer. She knew what I was say saying, but she said, what, what if there aren't any clouds? And I said, well, what if it's only a blue sky? And I said, well, then it's a blue sky buffer, or it's a plant buffer, or it's a friendly face buffer. There's always buffers. When you're looking for good, that's all you seem to see. When you're looking for bad, that's all you seem to see. It just works like that. It's, it works out perfect like that. So all you have to do, really, clear your thoughts. Think of thoughts that make you feel good. And then you get to feel good. And then you get to feel good all the time. You get to just choose how you feel. It doesn't even matter what's going on outside. It doesn't matter. Heaven is inside. You get to choose what you feel. And there's always cloud buffers. There are always cloud buffers, see? Cloud buffers. Cloud buffers. There's always cloud buffers. All you have to do is watch your thoughts and be careful and only allow the things that you want to be in there be in there. Why do you even need to think about all the negativity? If you think about the negativity, it's, it, it, well, negative. What is even negative? There is no, what is that? But if you think about thoughts that don't make you feel good, they become part of your life. 
And if you only allow in the thoughts that do make you feel good, you'll see that your life just starts feeling good and everything just seems to work out for the best. Because people by nature want to feel good. So if you're feeling good, the people around you feel good because they want to. And they're attracted to that. And then feeling good and people that feel good make good situations. It just works like that. I mean, it just, I mean, it's common sense. It just, it's not magic. It is magic. It's all magic. But it makes sense. It's not just chaos. There's, there's, it's just and sound and works like it works. And when you get the emotion out of it, then you get, you can work with it. And that way you can actually design your life around the emotions that you want to feel with your mind. It's a strong mind and heart. I like that. Okay, this is day three. This is nice, nice. I see, this is nice, beep beep. I'm so excited, I'm so excited. I feel free and freed. 